first Masters 1000 final for you here in Miami. And once again, finding ways to come through in the big moments. First off, how are you just processing the emotions of this next big step in your career? Well, uh, I have a lot of emotions right now. I mean, the, it's uh, a thing that uh, you dream of you know, when, you, when you, you were a child. And, uh, it's pretty, pretty good to be in a final here in Miami. I love playing here. The crowd was amazing. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna uh, affront the, the, the finals, like the, the, the first round. Or at least try trying to, to, to play like a, a first round, uh, trying to to mask the, the nerves. But uh, yeah, I think I'm gonna I'm gonna enjoy, and uh, it's gonna be a, a great finals. It was such a different match tonight than their last couple. Uh, points were much shorter. You only were able to generate three break chances. How did you stay patient so that you were there and fit for the big points tonight? Well, uh, I couldn't return, he, he, he says, but uh, I knew that the, the match uh, is going to be long sets like like uh, it did, uh, you know, 7-6, seven, 7-6. Six, seven, six. Uh, at the beginning of, of, the, of the set that I saw that I couldn't return, I, I remember to, to thought, uh, well, uh, we are going to play a, a tie break, 7-6, or, or at least try to, to keep myself on. And uh, yeah, I mean, uh, a little bit different just with, with serves, but uh, yeah, it's uh, a great win for me. Congratulations. Thank you very much.